After an entire week of murky weather, I've woken up to a beautiful day, which is perfectly in time for Lalande's Barbie weekend. We're going to be having a Barbie-themed party with our guests tonight. Our friends Curtis Ryan Woodside and his lovely husband Filippo are here. And before then, we're rushing out to the local wine festival to find wine for our patron day. Good morning. Good morning, morning. Everyone ready for the great wine festival? Yes. 2023? Yeah, I've heard a lot about it. Yeah, it's a shame you're not here by car, though, which means you can't drive yeah. back to Italy, though why would you take wine back to Italy? You've got plenty of wine, but from the other side, we don't have to drive, so we can drink. Yeah, okay, exactly. OK, perfect. <laughs> and you're coming, aren't you? I'm coming, and I think... And are you coming? Is that a no? And yeah, that's a, that's a, I don't have makeup on, don't film me. OK, actually, no, you look fabulous like yeah. that, though. Yeah, I like Thank it. You. I'm, uh, yeah... Uh, Marketing so for better. our garden's produce right now. Nice! Where is it? Tomatoes from the garden. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pavlina's coming? Yes, Excellent. No, quite a group of us. Yes. All right, now I'm going to have a cup of tea and not eat a pastry. I'm now actively not eating There's a pastry. An orange cake that Emma has baked. That is very It's good. so good. And Stephanie, I know you are like doing very light breakfast, <gasps> but technically it is 90% fruit. Thank you They're for that. Biggest fans. Thank you. Very good. That's not true, Emma. What's that? Oh, well, you are too. Yeah, and we're alive. We're the OGs, the originals. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> no, look at that. Just swapped like, just swapped like that. Just swapped. Just like that. Fickle. I said that was fickle. Well, Filippo has already said that he, he's going to marry Maria. No, no, <laughs> okay, so... No, I will really say this. Well, I've had one evening at so La Lande, honestly, wow. Yeah, no, yeah. it's a, a deal I'm very happy with. <laughs> Right, this afternoon I'll have a piece. I don't know if there will be still this afternoon. Yeah, that's okay. <sighs> I'll, I'll wrap you up this last. Every morning I walk out to the Jardin à l'Anglaise to go and phone my mother and Nick and Michael. So I do all my little phone calls in there in the morning. But today I can hear Buddhists chanting in the background. And that's because Curtis's husband is a Buddhist monk. And it's just so peaceful and calming and quite incongruous. I think it's the first time we've heard Buddhists chanting at La Lande. The peace of my secret haven has been ruined. I have an intruder. What the heck? Now, I know we have moles on the lawn. I'm upset enough about those, but now this is it. This is my sacred space. Not the sacrosanct Jardin Langlaise moles. Come on, you're just drawing attention to yourselves now. I am such a big softie when it comes to things like this, but I think it's going to have to be war. I don't understand what's happened with the weather. It was actually nice this morning and sunny for once. This is the weirdest summer. Now it's back to just grey and murky. And I have to say that pretty much all of us in the chateau are loving it because we all wilt in the sun. But not ideal for the guests who are here trying to enjoy a French summer. So welcome to Marie Cam again. We have been proposed to find some pink flowers for the dinner. <laughs> I don't really know what kind of pink we are going for, but I looked at these and they look absolutely stunning. We picked some Clarkia anemonia, which is beautiful. I haven't really seen them or worked with them very well, but I think the colour will be perfect. I'm wondering if we should have a little bit more Mm. Right, let's see if we can find any pink. They definitely put all the quirkier dahlias around here. I don't usually go picking flowers here because I like it just to look full and beautiful here in the front. But look, wow, since we're doing a special themed dinner, might as well just have a little look. I spotted the most beautiful pink dahlia. I think a couple of these would be right. The more you pick, the more they'll grow. Maybe three. If this doesn't say Barbie, I do not know what does. Starting to get there. Next up is these beautiful sweet peas, perennial sweet peas. I decided to get a whole bunch because <laughs> they are beautiful and they just give, give that little extra. So, I think so. I think we have a great selection here. Can't wait to put it all together over and out. Yeah. Curtis, we have a little gift for you. Oh, yeah. If you like it. Yeah. This comes from Tatinette. Yeah. No, this comes from Tatinette. No, from, it was from Johnny Stark. Stark. Really? Was it? Yeah. That's so sweet. Thank you. It opens up. It's, it's Are you able, desk. do you know what it, 
what it is because well it's no. The writing, no i don't mean that i mean the <laughs> i mean who's on the front yeah. it's like the goddess hathor with a pharaoh giving an offering to um osiris so that's as much as i can tell from it i love the way that you can do that though <laughs> just from that it's already more information than we had <laughs> it's lovely thank you and this is the blotter thing okay because oh, obviously wow. how do you live without a blotter obviously Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> you have to blot everything. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. It's so sweet. Give me a hug. We've rigged the local wine festival. We've decided that we need to line our stomachs before wine tasting. We need some, we need some food. This looks delicious and I can't describe the smell. We've left Filippo in the queue. You're a hero, yes, Filippo. Yes, I'll stay in the queue. Thank you. And we're going to have that pulled pork. It's just been warmed here in a sandwich with some chips. And we're in charge of finding wine. Yes. yes. We're starting with Domaine de la Vache. She looks extremely popular. We're starting off by trying a wine. Bonjour, I love this stalks. They've got nibbles to try. Delicious local goat's cheese, then a little saucisson. And this is the local pâté de pomme de terre, which is a potato pie. Cheers. 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 So finding the right wines for patron day. Exactly. So it's it's very job. tough. I was going to say, someone's got to do it, but yeah. Mm. I love it. It's very, very light, mm. which is perfect because we'll be having summer lunch, at least I hope so. I hope the weather will be better for the patron days. But for a light lunch, I think this is perfect and I think we can order it. I can't believe we've found one straight away. Good. You're writing a check. Oh, yes. We're in France now. <laughs> Checks are still a thing. This is the life. Thank you so much, Felipe. Thank you. So how is it to your Italian taste? It's very nice. Yes, that's literally the highest praise because you are you such an amazing no, chef. Very good. We've got some little <laughs> things. A little surprise, though. Mm -hmm. It's a surprise. We're not allowed to yeah, see what you've got. Well, I will show you. Got two okay, of these. okay. Oh, that's cute. Is it salt and um, pepper, I guess? Are they snails? Yeah, yeah they snails. Have you and eaten the... snails yet? Did you know it's, it's over there yeah, now? You can go and eat them. I... I might be brave. <laughs> I think it was the spoons I bought. Them Darling, they're really cute. They're cute. They're cute. So cute. and they won't um, deteriorate with oh, the yeah. salt because mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. the silver does, doesn't it? They're very cool. So we're allowed to see this. these. Oh, oh yeah, very nice. The polish up and the beautiful. Yeah, I need some cleaning. I feel like that's like your secret bag. There's a lot going on in yes, there. It's heavy Small than it amounts appears. are coming out, but a lot happening. Are you all ready for um, Barbie tonight? Yes. Pink. Okay. Should we go and do a bit of dancing? Okay. I think we're very Okay. I'm standing straight now. So let's see. I'll film you later and see how things are going. Now we're trying this one. This is what I love in this region is that the roses are almost white. It's Pinot Gris. Yeah. Yeah. They're delicious. I love the very pale roses. Et c'est chez vous alors? Oui. I am the sixth Six generation. Six generations? Yeah. Oh my goodness. That's incredible. And Rouilly is one of our most local wine producing regions. It's the closest to La Lande. Philip's bringing the car around. Thank you so much, Felipe. Oh, it's fun. So we bought a lot of cases of wine. The cheapest was four euros a bottle and the most expensive was but, eight euros a bottle. But good, they're all good. And that will see us through, along with wine that you bought last week, Philip, for a patron day, that's gonna see us through a year until the next wine festival, which is pretty good. I'm happy with this. And we have a mixture of whites, rosés and reds. You hear the band? Oh, we need to go find the band. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Merci beaucoup. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Philip, the band. We've got to go. You think I can leave it half of the road like that? Yeah, I do. Two seconds. Yeah. 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 Our lovely guests actually at the wine festival, so we're all hanging out together. It'll be so much fun. Yes. But I, I bought a um, a present for you to take to Dan's the next time you go. I, know. <laughs> I told him I'd get one and I haven't bought one yet, and Here I cannot is. imagine anything better than that. And you'll never lose it. <laughs>
Okay, Dan, you're watching. This is coming your way. That is awesome. Is that a bit of um, olive? Sure. I think it might be a bit of olive wood. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a bit high tech for Dan, to be fair. I don't know if you can use that. It's a bit. Oh, you tell you, it's only going in the cork. Right. It's only in the cork. in the cork. Okay. Okay, it's a step up from a leaf blower. <laughs> Love it. I believe we've lost the Filippos in a broadcast. We've lost. We were just focusing on the wine, on the band. Dan's corkscrew. Yes, Dan's corkscrew, and they've run off. Um, well, he's left a terrine behind, so he's clearly not doing as good a scanning as he usually does. There they are in the distance, clearly going that way. Oh, we're being oh, summoned. We found Emma, <laughs> so we're all starting to gather back together again. The scattlings of Lalande. <laughs> it's cool, right? It's an album, a photo it's, album. It's an old photo album. Oh, hang on, sorry, the cardigan's like falling. a vintage one. Yes. <gasps> oh, you're going to have so much fun. This is all your dreams come true. Yeah, put all my grandparents' pictures in there. Oh. Well, that's me not seeing you for the next few weeks <laughs> as you sit and fill your Isn't photo album. But it's more than beautiful. It's cool, right? I love it. I overpaid. And all the different... Oh, really? How much was it? Well, so we both heard him say 45 in French. Yes. He said 45. He said 45? And I said, yeah, all right. And then I gave him 50, expecting five in return. He said, no, 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 it's 55. But then I already given him the 50, and I thought, I'm now emotionally invested. In I'm now only five it. euros away so, from exactly. this book. So uh, I was already holding it at that point. What's it? A, B. A, B. C, D, E, F, G. Yeah. yeah, it's the beginning of the alphabet for it's all of the, the names of all the of the people of the in story, it. It's the beginning of the story, you know. 19th century, it's quite... It is, it is a proper fairy tale. You do expect it to say, once upon right? a time. Yeah, once upon a time. time. Was, 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 write it in it a little... Uh, once upon a time, there was a Philip. <laughs> <laughs> he arrived at a French chateau and met a Stephanie. I think the story goes back before that. I don't know, that's where it starts. Oh, where does it start? With my grandparents getting together. And then... Oh, so it's, quite, it's quite a big build-up, yeah, yeah, actually. Yeah. <laughs> it's the kids going Tolkien on us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mazagran. Now, Mazagran are these coffee cups. I will tell you more about them later, but we need them for patron day. All will be revealed, and they're one euro each. Very, very darling. Oh, Curtis, of course. Now, you know with the desk set we've just given you? Obviously, that's just a finishing touch. It's just screaming to go, no. I am wanted to, you like it. <laughs> Not at all. It's tough. Were you ready to swoop in? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I think there's a little pottery exhibition here. Nice There's lots of lovely things here. Oh, wow, that's very um, snaky. Let's not give that to Natty. Natty, look away. <laughs> very beautiful. We don't need any more no, no, cushions. No. It goes very well with my skirt, though. Yeah. Darling, did you see Girl with a Pearl Earring? I didn't. Yeah, in stained like glass. Version, yeah. That's cool. There's nothing like a French countryside rural fate. I mean, you see the most unexpected and, let's face it, pretty glorious things. We're back at La Lance and I'm going to go up and see Annalise soon to get ready for tonight. But first, I thought I would come to the courtyard and show you all of the lilies that have come out amidst the lavender. And there's just bees and hummingbird moths absolutely everywhere. There's the hummingbird moth. They're so pretty. And it's so wonderful because when we created the courtyard, I knew it would be perfect for the chateau, but I didn't realize how wonderful it would be for the wildlife. Hello, hello. Hi. Are you come to see the flowers? I have come to see the flowers. Oh, it's so beautiful. You know, I love fluffy flowers. And now we've got baby breath. It's fluffy. so beautiful. And I think it'll go really well with this week's flowers. Oh my goodness. I've just seen the Barbie theme flowers. <laughs> yes. They wow. Are magnificent. 
have I did a cheeky pick in the bed in front just for those uh, two, three. And they're beautiful. They are. So these are ours, all of these. Yeah. And these are ours as well, aren't they? So we're actually pretty well kitted out on the Barbie front anyway. Absolutely. And I also did a Holly Hops. Oh. And look at these, Cosmos, so beautiful. Oh, I love them. Um, and where do these come from? They're from the garden too. Yeah, they're just on the right as you come in. Oh, well, I thought they look very Barbie to me. And look what else we've got. Um, I used to not like Sinias at all, but... Me too, actually. This... They're not my favourite. No, but actually they've grown on me. And I, I can do... see why. I didn't know there was such a variety. Look at that one. Yeah. Oh, that's actually Scavias. Yeah. Oh, wow. He's tricked a few in there. <laughs> They're not zinnias. I say, so the ones I like are, in fact, still not <laughs> zinnias. It's, it's not looking good for the zinnias, is it? <laughs> well, um, there's loads of beautiful varieties these days, so we could try them in the garden if you fancy it. Little You're going to have to work a little bit harder on me to get me to love them, but you know what I'm going through because you've been through it yourself. I will work a bit harder. And then we have Rebecca and some chrysanthemum. So these might go well with the Barbie theme. Yeah, they sure could go nicely. That, but no, we can use them in the room. Yeah, we'll use those elsewhere. And then we have, I mean, oh, that's going to be great. Yeah. I really love that. I love that's that could maybe go into the bigger reception. For, yes. For so if you use the colours that don't fit in with the Barbie theme for the other rooms, yes. I we think can go we'll be all right. I crazy think. with the pink. Philip's planning total pink for the table. That's too expensive. Be expected, I think. <laughs> it's going to be splendid. Yeah, I it just will. love this, honestly. Okay, I need to hydrate after the wine tasting. Obviously. And yeah. Maria has apparently the perfect way of doing this. Yeah. With uh, Emma's, or rather Tasty Emma, which is her branding while she's at La Land. Tasty, tasty Emma. <laughs> tasty Emma, excellent. Yeah. She made Blackberry? a blackberry cordial. Yeah. That's our blackberry yeah. from the garden. Yep. Yeah. Yes. She spent all morning yesterday making it. Filippo was taste testing it. And okay. it's delicious. We were having it last night with the Prosecco. So I usually just have a jug of iced water always next to me on my oh, desk. You're going full in? Oh, oh I'm going in. Fully, fully, fully. Like I'm committed. Need, you'll need half the How much cordial do you put in? Probably it, isn't it? That's probably enough. Yeah. yeah. In with the Perrier, which is, I've been told that after very serious taste testing going on in the chateau, it is best with bubbles. Yeah, mm -hmm. alcoholic or otherwise. Okay, well, let's stick to the water after the wine tasting, I think. <laughs> Would I might like... add normal water to the top yeah. to have it slightly less. Would you like busy. a very tasteful plastic flamingo? I insist on having a plastic <laughs> flamingo. Thank you. What? Oh yeah, it does feel like a proper cocktail, it doesn't it? It might actually be quite hard to go back to just plain nice water after that. It's great that people are finding all these different things to do with our blackberries because we have so many, and I was so scared they wouldn't be used. But no, we have lots of things going on with them. Now I have to go and have a quick shower because Annelise is coming to do my hair for tonight's Barbie dinner. So I need to go and wash it first. Okay, so we're just thinking, turn me into Barbie. Oh, thank goodness, you're ready. I'm You've got pink. Like... Oh, Should we yes. do one of them, like a three, two, one. Barbie! <laughs> I know pink's my favourite colour for a reason. Yeah. Pink. This is it. It's all been leading up to pink. this moment. You're like, don't look at me, I'm shy. Pink. Oh my goodness, even that is pink. <laughs> my combs are pink, my towels are pink. I knew you were the right woman for this I love task. Pink. Have you done the guest hair for yeah, tonight so as well? Yeah, I've done two other, two other guests. One guest had hair down to oh, here. Gorgeous. And I've chopped it off and given You've chopped her it off? <gasps> some bangs. Wow. I've been like, been like fringe bangs. <laughs> Um, and the other guest in the room next door, she has had a nice tidy up. Her hair is also down to here. Wow. She looks like Ariel, like Rapunzel vibes right now. And she's, oh, I've also to see cut them. bangs in for her too. Okay. So basically I want all of that, just no bangs. No bangs. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. What are you wearing tonight? You'll see. Uh-huh. <laughs> Being most mysterious. You know, iron, I'm sure. How's the table going? It's finished. I've it's seen nice. It. It's so is it? Like it? I love it. Okay. Can't believe you've all seen it and I haven't seen it. It would be a surprise. It's really pretty. A little different than all the rest. I'm quite old fashioned, wear a hat, sometimes play chess. And when I'm out, I'm looking for that vintage flame. But all complexions that I adore. So hard to find, these seem impossible to score So I dream of to someday find that vintage love I kept on looking, but everyone's such a bore And out of a sudden, you came through the door I have a 
tiny little face amidst a lot of hair. Yeah. Couldn't have asked for more. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so now I need to just quickly put some makeup on and I'm going to run down. And get dressed and... Yeah. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We realised whilst Annalise was doing my hair that this appears to be a Barbie bedroom anyway. It's just all pink. I hadn't really noticed quite how pink this room is. This is the Barbie <laughs> dream house bedroom. <laughs> all my little girl dreams are coming <laughs> true. I think that the earrings really finished it off for the full Barbie look. I may have mixed tropical Barbie and... Flamingo. Ballroom Barbie. Ballroom Barbie. Flamingo Barbie. Yeah, but as what? Oh, Flamingo yeah. Barbie. Mm. Like it. Okay, we're going to go. Oh, I have to show you Ken. I love it. Yeah? Yeah, I like the fact that you've left uh, the bow tie open as well. I thought it was more like, you know, the whole... Decontracté, Ken. Yes. Nice. Exactly. That was exactly what I was going for. I can't wait to see Philip's table. Oh, my God. Goodness, that is pink. I think that pink is a severely underused colour in this chateau, in spite of our bedroom basically being pink. It's so good. Even with the pink glasses. Well, wow, these are plates that we got ages ago in Imaus, a whole set of them in case we needed extras for patron day last year. Now that is 80s perfection. And the finishing touch that just brings it all together on Marie's flowers. And you should do something amazing with all of those pink flowers. And I guess we all have to drink rosé all evening. Though, <laughs> frankly, the rosé looks positively orange against the table. The table's so pink. Nice. I love the flowers, Murray. Oh, I'm glad you like it. I love your dress. Thank you. Oh, cheers, everyone. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks for having us. Pleasure. Yeah. Thank you very much. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Curtis, is this the beetroot that you cheers. were sent out to pick? Yes, so I picked, I picked two beetroots. And I was very surprised with this beautiful oh, I know. They're pretty, aren't they? Yeah. I, I don't know what's nicer, that or the pink flamingo. They match your earrings Obviously, so well. I planned that yeah. meticulously. I'm loving the ties, by the way. The Thank fact you. that the two of you have matching, yeah. only I, not quite. This is thanks to Philip and Marie. So. Very, very good. <laughs> Kitchen Barbie. Yes. Oops. Well, I've gone for like Victoria Baking Barbie. Barbie. Baking Barbie. And my socks are pink, just for disclosure. <laughs> Thank so you. That's the best I can do. <laughs> since I'm not a massive Barbie fan. Um, I know you like brats, and that just means that, well, that's, like brats, that's just if I wrong. I would choose one, I'd go with those with personality and attitude and <laughs> grit rather than a bland plastic sort of. Oh, Barbie's cold the smile. intellectual giant of the doll yeah, world. Just they, How many jokes of brats? They reduce more <laughs> Just saying. Accessories don't make up for the lack of, uh, you know. <laughs> uh, therefore, just to stick with your brief, but to stay true to who I am, I decided that I will impart the, the dishes with some flavour. Uh, so we're starting with sort of North African uh, influences, think like Morocco and Egypt. So you've got a beetroot gazpacho with uh, hibiscus that you guys brought from Egypt. Yes. when you were on the, uh, on the trip last time with you. Um, and it also has uh, baccarat. And then uh, the can the candy, I think it's called candy stripe or candy cane uh, beetroot from our garden and some uh, goat cheese to bring it back to France. And uh, if you want to go Malibu, you can uh, stir it with your wonderful plastic. I do want to go Malibu. Yes. <laughs> well, enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. Okay. We have now moved on to a slight Mexican slash, don't kill me, Italian uh, influence. <laughs> <laughs> so the sauce I, I made, it's uh, one I've, I've never tried myself before, but I've read about it. It's called a chamoy sauce. Please correct me if you're from Mexico. I'm so sorry. Um, <laughs> and it's usually served on fruit. And so okay. they've done a pork tenderloin with uh, grilled peaches. I thought I might uh, include that in. Mm -hmm. And the nice thing about it is that I used the hibiscus flowers uh, that were left over from the, uh, the tea that I brewed for the gazpacho. And then we've got uh, our onions that have been uh, confit and some uh, prosciutto. Hopefully uh, you'll you. enjoy it. Yeah. It looks it's amazing. Barbie, you know? I, I tried to use everything that's pink. And the pork is pink. I've done what I was supposed to do. Thank you very it's much. It's perfect. Thank, Thank you. you. It's incredible. It's great. There I was thinking we didn't have enough pink flowers on this table. Yeah. It's a, a raspberry mousse and we have a shortbread with uh, rose water and uh, raspberries, fresh raspberries. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. And, Thank by the way, can I just say that two people said that your main course was the best they'd uh, ever had. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 
thank you for joining us for Barbie Night at La Land. A huge thank you to all of my patrons and a reminder that this week's patron video is this magical evening that we had at the Chateau de Lillette with Vivienne and Simon from Chateau Love and Curtis Ryan Woodside and his husband Filippo. We had a picnic on the lawn and visited the Renaissance Chateau and attempted to tango the night away. Today I'd like to say a huge thank you to the Dauphins and Dauphines of La Land. Susan Stevens, Monty Stapura, Tracy Truett, Michael Tuck and Renee Vallelli. Thank you so much for supporting the Chateau Diaries. Lots of love to everyone and can't wait to see you next time. Thank you.